what makes this lab or the crab lab unique is that we're in an optometry department and we have researchers who are optometrists but we have a mixture of different researchers so we have computer scientists mathematicians psychologists and we even have a health economist as well and this means that we're interested in a variety of topics but all of those topics really fall under the broad umbrella of, of measurement techniques in vision. It's definitely beneficial to be working with people in interdisciplinary kind of backgrounds, for example, Wei who's got a computer science background, if we need a programme for something, he's your man. Um, and it means that sort of at any one point, if there's an aspect of your research that, you know, you've got a question on, there's always someone to go to and you always get different kinds of feedback from different kinds of people as well. It's a really nice um, way to, um, to sort of bounce ideas off of each other. There's at least four different kinds of themes that we're interested in. Um, we're very much interested in imaging and image processing and some of the new imaging devices such as optical coherence tomography and developing um, software that clinicians can use to better manage patients with those instruments. We have a long-standing interest in measuring visual function Another strand of our work is we're very much interested in what happens in the eye clinics, in, in NHS eye clinics. And there we look at large scale data in order to assess um, how good we are at um, health service delivery. And then the other theme of work is really trying to relate all these measurements to what people can actually do in everyday life in terms of their vision. So we do a lot of studies here where we measure uh, visual performance in things like face recognition, but then we also have skills where we can analyse and interpret that data and that's where the statisticians and computer scientists become involved. I think the CRAB lab is a, a lab full of uh, diversity, full of uh, energy uh, and uh, it's a lab full of people you know, who are uh, really enthusiastic in the research. As a researcher you've got to be quite well rounded, not just in your specialist uh, interest or your PhD thesis topic. And so, I guess, yeah, we have that sort of uh, happy mix, really.